hi guys welcome to our channel uh to our subscribers we just want to say thank you for your continued support thank you for watching commenting liking and sharing our material if you are new here we just want to say welcome and uh, please remember to subscribe and also to click on the notification bell so that you may be notified whenever we have a new upload other than that welcome stay tuned and enjoy our news update Good evening guys, the latest of today is about Autopex, the company that manages our Translux and city to city buses. Let's get into that story. It has been reported that Autopex won't be able to pay its employees full salaries for Jen. This is according to the notice they issued to their staff members. The company blamed the setbacks on serious operational challenges which impacted the cash flow. This was their statement. It reads as follows. On Monday, the 27th of Jan, we'll unfortunately not be able to meet the full salary obligations for the month of Jan. We have managed to collect some funds from the fair revenue to pay you at least 50% of what is due to you. The balance will be paid at a date not yet confirmed, it is said. Autopex uh, falls under Prasa. Prasa is a subsidiary of a uh, passenger rail agency of South Africa, a state-owned entity which was last month placed under administration because of corruption and maladministration. Last week, Transport Minister Figile Mbalula, whose department is responsible for Prasa, described the company as a broken organization struggling to provide an efficient commuter and passenger rail services. The Auditor General 2019 uh, report found that the company regressed in its uh, audit outcome for 2018-2019 financial year. As such, uh, $27.2 billion was flagged as an irregular expenditure. The notice stated that Plaza and Department of Transport were given responsibility to turn around Autopex in order to make it a functional business. The bus company has joined a growing number of struggling state-owned state-owned entities which are also struggling to pay their employees the salaries this month the nuclear energy corporation of south africa nexa was also having problems in paying the employees their salaries they had uh, cash flow problems and the uh, saa was also uh, having issues there were fears that saa will also not be able to pay its employees but the matter was later resolved it seems like things are getting worse and worse on a daily basis for our economy. We need to have our side hustles and hustle harder. Thank you so much. That will be all from me. Do leave your comments and let us know of your views regarding this. 